So he runs back, hops in the car, all before the light turns green, and he's just like, Woo! He's like, he just, he's so amped up, and he just goes, got my phone back, and I got his phone. Like, what? Like, he's so hype, and he's like, we're just like, oh, no. And, uh, it was lit. <laughs> You want a greenie? Oh, you got a green. Kona, me and Kona both equally have love in green bags that zip lock and unload them. I'd be on greenies too. <laughs> I never knew me and Kona had this same. Oh, Kona wants the greenie. <laughs> and she gone. Right now, I'm rolling to uh, Urban Cafe. I got my man. His Urban friend. I got my, <laughs> I'm rolling to Urbane Cafe with my Urbane friend. Urbane friend. Okay. <laughs> Basically, we were just uh, editing a video back at my crib that uh, Ooh. SK directed. Ooh, the Buff Game. SK, SK's been getting on his directing tip a little bit lately. And, Shout out uh, to the Buff Nerds, you know, who came up in, in the game. Buff Nerd, you know, apprenticeship. Learned a lot. <laughs> Learned a lot from this, from this man, this camp. Buff Hey man, they'll be coming at Jake with them stupid questions. We be working hella hard. Jake works really hard at what he does, so it takes a lot of work to direct music videos. So more put, power. Put some respect on my name. <laughs> put some res put some respect on his name. We should do story time. Story time. <laughs> Basically, today's story time is gonna consist of how we first met and the epic story that was our first meeting. How Jacob met Samuel. All right, so long time ago, getting ready to shoot my first video with Jacob, that's him. That's me. Um, for highlights. And already, it was a big, big deal. The night before I am at the lounge where we're gonna shoot the video, um, singing karaoke. And I'm singing This Is How We Do It by Montel Jordan. It. it goes like that. And <laughs> um, my phone falls out of my pocket, but I don't know this because I'm killing This Is How We Do It. <laughs> um, and I realize after I'm done singing that my phone is gone. So I look and a group of people who were in the corner of the room had left and vanished just immediately when I'm done. So I'm like, these motherfuckers done stole my motherfucking phone while I'm singing this is how I'm doing. So I'm panicking. I have like the treatment. I have a bunch of shit for the video. People are calling and this, me. And this is the night before the video. I'm panicking. So it's, I gotta pick up Jake at 10 a.m. It's three o'clock in the morning. I decided to go online. Like, let's see if these motherfuckers try to like put it on Craigslist or try to sell my phone online. So, and boom, black iPhone. It was like a four at this time. Black iPhone four, black case, for sale, three hundred fifty dollars. I'm like, what the fuck? These motherfuckers try to sell my phone the same night. It had like, oh. well, like it just a few hours later, they hit it. They put it up with the quickness. Super quickness, super, super scam mode. So I, I made up a fake email. I was like, yo, I'm really interested in your phone. I'm working graveyard right now at Mirage. You know, I finessed the situation really, really finessy. So I hit him up. He hits me back that morning before I go pick up Jake. Like, all right, yeah, let's get down. I'll sell you the phone today. Then I was like, so we gotta go handle some business. And as, as we're walking towards the car, he's kind of breaking down exactly what he's just telling, like about his phone being gone, this and that. And so yeah, we're headed to Jack you in the Box. five new text messages. So yeah, we're headed to Jack in the Box right now and we about to go get my phone back. So we were, his homie Sam's cousin and friend went inside to play gotcha. the, buyers. the Buyers. And me, Sam, and his manager were sitting like in the truck, all like hunched down, like waiting for this car to pull up. And Sam's like, I bet you it's like some little Asian dude with like a rice burner. And sure enough, like, two minutes later this like little like rice burner car comes pulling in and sam's like that's it right there that's it it pulls in and then just pulls out and leaves the parking lot and we're all sitting there and sam's like go go and again mind you 
I just met these guys. I flew into town to shoot a music video and I'm like, what have I gotten myself into? But it gets even crazier. Immediately, I'm like, yo, let's chase this fool. Mike is Mike, my manager is like, what? Like follow him? Like, yeah, after him. <laughs> um, and Jake is in the front seat. I'm in the back seat. Jake is just silent. He doesn't, he is just like, what the fuck is going on right now? So we pull up to the light and we're behind this guy. The guy has no clue that we're behind him. I hop out the car, broad daylight. 12 busy intersection busy intersection in vegas in really out in these streets i bust out the car like this i run up to the guy i fucking try to open the door he doesn't the door's locked i bang on the fucking window like this i was like give me my motherfucking phone give me my motherfucking phone give me my motherfucking phone cut to jake jake did that shit happen that shit happened like i'm sitting in the front seat of the car like Oh my gosh. Just watching this at a busy intersection, like the front car in the main intersection, Sam's banging on this dude's window, then all of a sudden just rips the door open. The door goes flying open. He just reaches inside and just starts going ham on this dude. Me and Mike are sitting at the car behind, like sitting behind the car looking at this like, like, what is happening? Go on, motherfucking phone. So I bust open the door. I rip the door handle off and I fucking punch him in his chest a couple good times. I'm not that violent of a person. I'm a nice <laughs> dude, but he stole my really phone. Really is. Stole my phone, so I, he tried to he tried to keep the phone in his hand. I ripped, it, I ripped his hand off trying to rip the phone out, and I punched him in his chest a couple <laughs> times. Did I not punch him in his chest a couple he times? He definitely punched him in the chest a few times. Not like disrespectful, trying to make him bleed. I punched him in his chest like, boy, don't you Yeah, he didn't, he didn't go for the face. He went for the chest. Just, ugh, ugh, ugh. I punched him in his chest a couple times, and then as I was getting ready to fucking tell him about himself, I saw his phone. I saw his phone sitting there. You know what I did? I took his phone. <laughs> I took my phone back, and I took his phone. I was like, now, we, now you ain't got no motherfucking phone. So he runs back, hops in the car, all before the light turns green, and he's just like, <sighs> He's like, he just, he's so amped up, and he just goes, got my phone back, and I got his phone. Like, what? Like, he's so hype, and he's like, we're just like, oh, no. <laughs> and uh, it was lit. The fool still had my contacts in the phone. He didn't even, like, wipe it all away. Like, it was just, it was just a mess. But, like, it just shows you that, you know, there's some people out here that aren't really about that action, and some people that are about that action. And I am about that action. Jacob is about that action. So that is the story of when I very first met SK and how our friendship started. It's deep, bruh. So now y'all know why I'm in every video and shit. <laughs> Alright, bro. Hey, what's going? All right, bro. Peace, peace out, peace. man. Stay strong. Go Buzz Mary. Right now I'm on the way to Demrick's house. Um, we're linking up to shoot a couple one takes um, for exclusive content for this channel. So on my way to meet Demrick, shoot a couple one takes. It's gonna be dope. Cookie bomb. Steph and Curry with the cookie. So right now I'm outside Demrick's crib. He's just inside, kind of rehearsing the lyrics. Uh, we're letting the speaker charge. So as soon as all that's good to go, then uh, we're gonna get shooting. What up, up, nerds? What's happening? I'm Demrick, man. Make sure you check out all my videos on the channel, man. Shout out to my homeboy, Jake. We make magic every time. <laughs> cool. Yeah. All right, ready? That 
was the one. Uh, we're finishing up here. <laughs> We're about to go on to the next location and shoot the second one take of the day with my boy Jacob Owens. Buff nurse! Did it go good? Things went awesome. <laughs> Fucking great. We knocked out we knocked out a couple good things today, man. We uh did two one takes and we went to my favorite dispensary, Green Wolf, and I picked up some pop. You have a look out for this shit, man. It's going down, man. Me and Jacob, we back at it. Buff nerds, Demrick, it's going down. Stay tuned. Just finished shooting for Demrick, as he just said. And uh, now I'm headed back to uh, headed back to his house to get in my car, then my car to my house to edit these videos, go to the gym, pack, get ready for AZ. It just it just keeps on going. It's the life you live. It's the life I live. <laughs> Brother man. Yes, sir. Take it easy. Peace. Peace. So right now, Yates, bruh, my roommate and hood dance rapper, is in my kitchen, turning up to his own music. Let's go have a look. Pull out and she like be my baby daddy. I'm like, oh no, no way. Yates, bro! So I just came back from the gym, got a workout in, and I come home to a video shoot happening in our kitchen. The homie Ahmad came over and is actually using our kitchen to do a music video. So I'm gonna go take a little look, see what we got going on. Yates, so I heard not only are you a hood dance rapper, but you're a hood dance filmer. Well, usually I got the iPhone 6, but today I upgraded to the Mark 69. You know? <laughs> What's one of its main features? Zoom. <laughs> <laughs> 